No hay. 495. It's always a good feeling. So in case you guessed it, we're moving hay around today. Um, Jason's got a load out. 495. We're gonna have to hand load some. Ah, oh, the sun feels so, so good. It's been cold and windy and we're gonna look at like 50s the next couple days. So we're gonna try to get that barn, the barn um, metal on when Jason gets back. Uh, I am sore. I'm coaching Keaton's basketball team and uh, to encourage the boys to run a little harder, I've been running too. I tell them all the time they can come home and come work with me. They don't like that idea very much. <laughs> oh, I hope you guys have a great day wherever you're at, whatever you're doing thankful for you guys. Make sure you guys are subscribing, hitting the like button, commenting below, and that little notification bell all helps out. Like how many bales does the barn hold? 67, 20. Full of little squares. So how high is that? Is that 11 stacks high? On edge. On edge. Seven bays? Oh, 960. So each bay, so like each. In that's we need each post. Post to post, 960. Like this grab doesn't have one, so we either ran out of twine in the field or whatever, but you can see how they're stacked. 15. Makes it easy to load. Jason can usually load and unload a trailer with the grab within um, half an hour, 20 minutes. Ryder must have a mouse or something. We've got a lot of hay moving out. 
as we uh, get closer to winter. So we'll probably talk more about the hay as we load out. But if you have questions about the grabber, any of the Acune system, we've been running them since 2014. a quick outfit change it's obviously hat season 24 7 around here no shame in my uh, unwashed hair game not even worry about it okay let's go see if Jason's ready to run out it's always a good feeling to roll out together I don't want to get too close uh, I do not need um, hay in my uh, Over pie for breakfast, right? <laughs> I think it almost tastes better the second day. Yum. It's a little frosty this morning. I'm finally, finally getting out of the house. It's 9.05. Um, I have been just doing some editing and some different stuff. Jalen and I were just playing catch up this morning. I'm going to go down and chore, and then I don't know how much Jason's going to need me for now. I may go back home and just do some stuff. We'll see. I was hoping for the day off. I don't think that's going to happen. I mean, is there ever a day off in farming? I had pie for breakfast. Not as good as my mama's pie, but it's all right. It's still good. My crust is just falling apart. Like, that's a fun fact for you guys. I don't know if you guys know that my love language is to bake and cook. I, I love doing that. Um, you guys might, probably are not gonna see that. Who am I kidding? Um, but I will be sharing the recipes on my blog. So don't forget to uh, go check that out. All the merch is on sale. Uh, not honestly sure if I'm gonna keep doing it, to be honest a lot of extra that I just don't have time for and it's it's not necessarily something I need to do to um for myself busted some bales the other day when I was loading out with Jason so uh, I'm coming to retrieve them to feed to the ponies oh I better put these batteries on charge they got left in the truck. No hay goes wasted around here. I just don't feel like there's all that exciting stuff going on. And if I don't find it exciting, how do I expect you guys to find it exciting? Right? Um, this is the last weekend of youth deer season. So rifle season is over. I am hoping to get out in the stand, um, shoot my crossbow and get me a deer. Um, we'll see what happens, obviously. These are just practice arrows that I got hanging out in the pickup. Uh, Keaton got himself a nice little little one. Um, did it all by himself this year, so pretty proud of him. And then uh, Jalen and I haven't got to go out really. I've went out two nights, but one one day I went out with Jason, and that was kind of comical. I may have to tell you guys that story later. Needless to say, he scared off the buck that I was going to shoot. And I haven't been out to the stand since. So, I got chores to do. You guys will probably get tired of me yip yakking. Are you still snoozing? <laughs> Sleep.
sleepyhead. Hi. Good morning. Oh, you're telling everybody else good morning too? Yeah. We're going to turn Shiloh out here in just a few minutes. Get everybody fed. And, uh, yeah. Probably won't be today, but next week, hopefully, get the skid loader in here and get some stalls picked up and just do some cleaning. We've just been on the go. It's been, like, nonstop. It seems like every day something going on. Um, the barn has taken a lot of our energy. Jason's been selling hay left and right. The shop here at the homestead at Jason's parents' place, they've been pouring concrete. They're going to work on it again all this week. So just so many different things. Um, oh, I need to get some feed. I need to get some feed. Put in my barrel. get this Perina Impact, then um, Storm gets this grower, the Ultra grower. It's got just a little bit of different makeup to it. It's got some extra fat protein in it. And then Rocky gets um, something completely different from Petco because he doesn't need a whole lot of sugar content. He's just an older guy just enjoying life. When the barn gets built or finished getting together, um, Shiloh will actually go to the farm so we can check cows every day and ride over there and just, <sighs> I'm ready for that. Are you ready for that? <sighs> My soul is, that's for sure. Kind of in this funky growth stage. You're not going to kick up your heels for him today? Guess not. It isn't on. No, it's not on. What was you saying about it? <laughs> it's a what kind of truck? I don't. It's a tiny truck, ain't it? Yeah. Here, hold it. I think I have better driving skills than you. <laughs> 